Welcome back to NTG, guys. We, we returned to you in the middle of a street fight. Between, like, a preppy and uh, a preppy yeah, college kid. And, uh... There's and mugging AI. Oh, fuck. Should we help him? I don't I think he not. needed it. Remember that nudge? <laughs> Look at that guy who's like, oh! So. Oh, no! Hey. Pixel, where are we going to do this? Burns the mystical sun. Do you see it? This one? Hmm? Burns into Go the in there. what? Oh! No, oh. not there. The mystical yeah. sun in the top of the building there. What sun? That one. This one? Yeah. That's supposed to be a sun? It's not a sun, it's an orange it's purple. light in a window. It's oh yeah, purple. purple light in a window. Well, if you look at the actual window, it's a sun shape. Is it? I mean, I guess vaguely. Just put a door right there. It'd be Harry Potter's house. There's a lot of rooms in here. Oh, it's gonna be a maze. Oh. oh you nice. got it right first try. Sweet. Was that supposed to be a? Okay. Hey, pal. Greetings, Neomate. Might I assume you received my invitation? I have been looking forward to meeting you for quite some time. Strauss. Maximilian Strauss. I am the regent of this chantry. Welcome. Might I suggest a razor with which to shave your head completely bald perfectly? I often embraced within the pyramid. We share the same blood, you and I. But there is much you have yet to learn about our clan. Oh! This new life yeah, in which you find yourself region. undoubtedly seems strange. So each sure there's like a, a different house for each of the clans in I this part of LA? Which I am able. Yep. Cool. This guy's my favorite. Because you're a Tremere, he's a Tremere, and stuff happens if you the pyramid is the be friends with him. Of our clan, with each level of advancement watched over by the next. There are apprentices here at the Chantry who are my charges, and I have a lord who watches over me and other local regents. And so cool. In most cases, Tremere are very selective about who they embrace and how it is done. There are traditions and laws that we adhere to, so the circumstances... Always traditions and laws, man. Were, let us say, unconventional. Therefore, you are outside the pyramid. Such things are possible, young one. But you would have to prove your worth to the clan before it would even be a consideration. Tremere guard their secrets well. Perhaps it is something we will speak of later. A regent is the leader of a chantry, as well as a teacher to young Tremere apprentices who are studying the mysteries of our clan. A chantry is a local gathering place for those of the Tremere clan. I live here, as do apprentices from time to time. Neat. Let me give you some advice, young one. Your survival in kindred society will often depend on your ability to find out yourself what is going on around you. Remember that well. <laughs> thanks, oh, thanks, Dad. Dad. <laughs> this actually kind of makes you want to play through as every single clan, doesn't it? Yeah. To see all the yeah. different things. Each clan has something unique that happens to them. Yeah. It seems that disease Except Toreador. Fuck Toreador. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, that's not true. Even Toreador do have... Our particular appetites, the local kindred are more than concerned about these developments. Dude, that shit is whack. Yes, indeed. <laughs> My opinion yes, is indeed, that it is wow. responsible for these outbreaks, their precipitous indulgence of certain... Great Scott, this is heavy. Things. Ergo, their need for the watchful eye of the... Cabal. Best clans are Nosferatu and Malkavian, apparently. Hmm, an interesting proposition. If you succeed in finding Do vampires still need glasses? An end to no way. I will compensate you appropriately. For well, why wouldn't they? Very well. Again, I recommend speaking with the Anarchs. 
You can find Wait. most of them at the local watering hole, reveling in the vices of their former lives. I believe the place is called the Last Round. Yeah, it's, I mean, it wouldn't fix their eyesight, would it? Becoming a vampire? Do you think it would? The camera alone. I don't it know. I mean, maybe. That exists if they needed them when they turned, then yes, yeah. There are specific codes of behavior that we have this guy's just like, I didn't need them. The but don't, they just look good on me. But don't vampires have like heightened vision and what shit? So like, wouldn't that know. help? I'm not Get sure. The... I mean, it depends on the game, right? Like, Twilight Vampires sparkle. Yeah. Sparkle and go fast. I really like this guy on a Camarilla playthrough because he's utterly beneficial to everything that a Tremere is. He'll give you cool shit later. Oh, cool. So I oh, highly cool. suggest licking his dick. Licking his dick. I do everything he says. Be not as nice as possible to him. Oh, you went magic circle. Try yeah, that there's... again. You have to go the right way. Zig zigzag is the way. Yeah, then there. There you go. What's upstairs? Something Ooh. cool for you later if you keep doing his stuff. Ooh. Well, cavians aren't all completely insane. They just have some mental disorders. Imagine, like, the vast majority of Malkavians are just, like, autistic kids. The worst vampire clan ever. Okay, first off, um, there's a street vendor that I want you to find. Can we sell him our junk? Yeah. I think he's to the right oh, right now. Oh, fuck, dude. Man, my nose is falling off. Never mind, he's not there. There's, You'll know him when you see him. There's a van. Just keep going down Main Street. I recall Street seeing a van before. Yeah. Uh, that's the last round. I want to see if the knife that the dude dropped is still there, so you can get some extra bucks. No, you're going the wrong way. Extra it's the other way. But th that's the last round for after. Okay, yeah. <sighs> hmm. There's a van right there. Okay, there's the knife. No, it's uh. A, hmm. That's an awesome van, by the way. I want one of those. You like fucking Not that hipster kind of van. vans. It's not a hipster like van. More like a truck, actually. There's a truck right there. No. no. It's a receiving dock. It's on. It's on the main path. You'll see it. Uh, there's there's a taxi that'll take you out of here. There's an inverted skirt lady. There's a truck. It's it's a truck that looks like that, but this is not the right truck. What the fuck? Keep, keep going. It's all just one big street. <laughs> Didn't realize how he... Oh, yeah, this is the alleyway. To your right. Oh. There. This guy, eh? Hey, pal. Baby girl, I saw you come from down the street and I started praying to the Lord to find it in his heart to send you to me. And hallelujah if he didn't come through for me. Welcome to Fat Larry's Truck of Man. I am the proprietor and salesman of the month for several years <laughs> in a row. Guy. The I love call how he me, speaks oh, at the God. side of his mouth. But you can call Watch me that. Fat Larry with a F-A-T because there's more of me to love. Speaking at the side of his mouth, it's great. More to me to love. Hey Dev, you're you're in the club and this guy smacks your bitch's ass. What do you do? <laughs> Fry. <laughs> Shave his fro off. <laughs> Pools closed. Now, How about a hotel? Question, but a better question to be, what don't I got in this truck? Because at Fat Larry's, my motto is everything's got a price, but I probably know somebody who can get it anyway. All right. 
Let's sell some counterfeit nah, basketball I jerseys. What I like to hear. But it's like this. I say my best up for select clientele. Now that don't mean I don't appreciate your business. It's just, you know, business. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. All those guns and shit, don't yeah. bother. You can get them free. It's the uh, the clothing you want. Heavy clothes. You want that. Alright, we got it. Everything else should get free at some point. Alright. Let's sell, well, sell the junk, right? Right. Say now, Wonder Girl, seeing the kind of commando gear you've been stocking up on, you ain't just using that stuff for keeping the neighbors away from your shit, is you? <laughs> wow, 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 uh, that's your business, okay. I just figured somebody with a shopping list like yours might be up for a little actions all, all right? Oh, is he gonna give us a. Yo, I need a hardcore pimp killing Cleopatra Jones for a super sized skull. Straight up Foxy Pam Greer style. Still with me? I don't you know what you're talking down. about. <laughs> I got a tip. He needs you to kill some dudes. Yeah. And some local boys I meet down at the nearby parking garage to carry out a business deal. Now, I can't tell you what they is exchanging, but let's just say a certain client of mine is ready to drop some Uncle Sam sized bucks to acquire what's in briefcase number one. You get it for me. I'ma not only give you a cut. But I roll out my special stock as well. Now, oh. That sound? What is he selling the special stock? Yeah, that's what I like to hear. Uh, ammo for straight out beefier guns. For Terminator well. type, I'd suggest you buy some heavy firepower before you roll up to the parking garage. You need anything? Absolutely not. You're a Tremere. <laughs> <laughs> you have infinite ammo. You're going to sell um, the old clothes, I guess, and sell all the weapons? You can... I think you can sell the steak now. Yo, 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 I got dinosaur eggs. We don't know what kind. Uh, for zero. Can't sell it. This week only. Sell the ring. Check it out. Yeah. Sell that. Step right up. Can you sell the... Yo, 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 I got dinosaur eggs. Sell the tire iron. Sell the knife. Yeah. Sell the arm. Can you sell the, um, driver's license? I don't think you can, but just see anyway. Check it out, check it nope. out, step right Man, up. Never mind. Okay, that's it. Light clothing, right? You can sell that. Can't you? You might be able to, no, you might be able I to sell it once you change it. Yeah, the, uh, I can't sell it if I'm wearing, wearing it. it. Oh, you gotta equip it, right? Yeah. Change out of that shit? Don't sell it just in case. We can sell it later. I'm not sure if it means anything later. Use. There you go. What do you look like now? Let's see. Z. Do not attack. But yeah, please press. Attack. You can see yourself kind of there, but a little bit. Info. Look, well, can't you press use the go into third person mode press like you info. did before? Press info. Go to. Ooh. No more crazy ass skirt anymore. Yeah. That would look sick. It actually is something that you might wear in real life if you're being ridiculous. Okay, anyway, you want me to go uh, to the go, character? Go sheet? find the knife that some dude dropped. Press info. Info? Go back, press L again. L? What? Info. Next question. I don't want to talk to you. Move. Oh, your voice is cutting out. Move. R.I.P. Pixel. I don't want to talk to you. Move. You not hear me right now? Uh, you're back now, I think. What the hell? Go to info. <laughs> info. Press L. <laughs> there you go. Now you can see what your character is. Oh, cool. Would you do? Oh, yeah. She, she looks like somebody who'd be, who'd be like snapping her fingers at a poetry reading instead of clapping. Yeah, there's a few other outfits, and the final outfit's really cool. But now you've got some more strength, uh, more defense. 
sweet. There was a knife on the road. Find it. I mean, we don't need a, we don't need that many bucks, do we? Uh, the final armor is really expensive. Mm. It's like a thousand bucks just for that, and then you have to buy guns. It'll be on the way to the uh, last round, anyway. Oh, okay. That, that's that's not that's that's. Jesus, what is this place? Yeah, it's an abandoned me. hospital, and you can go in. There's so many things you can do now. Hi, lady. Uh... Yeah, sure, go in there. You going in? I know. Guess we're going in. Did you like the uh, the ghost hotel, Naomi? No. Is this worse? I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> no. Nope. Don't that. No nope, ghosts. No nope ghosts Naomi. in this playthrough. Goodbye. Naomi. Nope. 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 You gotta do it. Nope. Naomi. No. Get back there, says Marie. Make me. Do Wait, it. you can't. No. Nope. It's, it's no. Not, it's not scary. I don't believe it's you. It's not scary. Yeah, turn, turn back around. No. Nope. Turn back around. Get to go to last round. Turn back around. No. <laughs> Just go back in. Just go back in. Just go back in. Just go back in. <laughs> Just go back in. <laughs> Just go do it. Naomi. <laughs> no, don't go in there. Where are we going? Uh, that way. It's either go to the hospital or visit Antifa, your choice. I'm visiting Antifa. You wimp. <laughs> we'll have to do oh, it eventually. You're gonna need some lube to get Naomi inside. Choose Antifa. <laughs> God no, damn it, I went wrong. the wrong way. Okay. I didn't know it was so easy to get lost. But yeah. Everything looks the same and then it suddenly looks different. It's really confusing. <laughs> There's a skyline. Your phone's buzzing. Who is it? Let's keep going. Just follow the street. There's only two ways. It like goes left or right. So we're gonna go towards. Just keep following this path. We're gonna go towards the hotel. At the oh, hotel, wait. the hospital. We're gonna go there. We're gonna go there. <laughs> we're gonna go keep there. Going. We're gonna go there. <laughs> we're gonna go there. <laughs> yeah, oh, we're gonna go so there. <laughs> Hooray. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, where is it? Oh, there it is. We're gonna go there. We're gonna... We're gonna go there. <laughs> we're gonna... <laughs> we're gonna... We're gonna go there. <laughs> Naomi! <laughs> yeah? <laughs> it can't just be this the whole time. <laughs> Stand up. Have control of the mouse. Yeah, we were gonna go there. <laughs> Get in there. <laughs> You're such a coward. Yeah. Get in there. No. It's fun. No. It's fun. I don't believe you. Okay, I got myself lost again. <laughs> You're so stupid. The audience demands you go in there. Nope. You are beholden We're to us. We're visiting Antifa. You can't make me. Is that ha. Antifa right there? Yes. Are you sure? How do you know? Because it's the last round. Oh, he's playing Call of Duty. Yeah, man. Call of Duty sucks. He looks just... It's like the, it's the same guy. Yeah, the same bartender. Just reskinned. Just, just reskinned, yeah. Hey! Look at who made it back in one piece. Out of Santa Monica, kiddo. Is this guy? I, am the <laughs> I can't imagine you did. 
I'm too busy getting pushed around by every vampire with a week of seniority over you, am I right? That's usually the way the story goes. Same old bullshit politics. For You're supposed to be playing this to amuse us, to not keep fun. from doing things you want to see, Naomi. Wahaha. Wahaha. Yeah, not a moment too soon, huh? Someone must have put a word out. Now, here's an interesting little scenario. I'm just gonna run this by you, see what you think. All right. What if the prince got the word out to the Sabbat that you were the one to blow up their warehouse? Hey, it's just a theory, man, but who else is gonna be watching you so closely, knowing where you're going and all that? Hmm. I'm not saying he's working with the Sabbat. I know he ain't, but he sure as hell could have put the word out there on the street where the Sabbat would pick up on it. <sighs> Let your bitch is a good song, hands down. Every time I talk to Marie, she always seems like a very, you know, wholesome, chill, happy-go-lucky kind of person. And then she's she knows she knows be this fucking bondage queen who's listening to death metal. The rich get richer, keeps the powerful in power. Look at why you're out in Santa Monica in the first place. Cause Prince LaCroix said so. <laughs> Cause he never thought you'd make it back. If Nines didn't stand up for you in the courtroom, you would have been toast right there, man. Everybody knows that. Hmm. Public relations, man. Calculated risk. Ventura were born in a boardroom. When Nines called him out, LaCroix realized it was time to show a carefully measured dose of Camarilla compassion. <sighs> LaCroix is the boss of Camarilla in L.A. That's it. <laughs> LaCroix is the boss. <laughs> That's rich. The free living dead, kiddo. A lot of people like to use the label Anarchs. What the hell that means? Anarchs. That's got a nice kick to it, though, huh? <laughs> yeah. Sure thing. Yeah, this, this, this is the Antifa stuff, I assume. The Anarchs. I mean, Antifa's an anarchy group, so. Yeah, I could tell you about the history of the movement about our struggle. What's any of that shit mean, anyway? Do we want to sit through history class here? <laughs> it does. It's got to sound like Antifa. <sighs> We don't know who the fuck we're fighting. I'm sure they're Nazis, though. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Fight harder than the other son of a bitch. Every time I yank a jawbone from a skull and ram it in my socket, I know I'm building a better future. <laughs> Wow. Peace. Hold on, Naomi. We've got to cut episodes here. We're at 23 minutes. I feel so short. Look at this. Yeah, Jesus. What the so, fuck? It's like you in real life, dude. I know. Don't talk to him yet. the talk of the town. Mr. Child for Camarilla Benevolence. What does the prince have his little bitch doing today? 